Hello everyone. I know that there's been some concern about self-service not showing up on your student's iPad. I'm going to take you through the steps and how to get that to work for you. First thing is you will need to go to settings. Once you're at settings, it should already be on general. But before you do anything, make sure if your student is logged in to their iPad that they are signed out prior to doing the next step. The next step would be to go after they're signed out to general. At the bottom of general, you're going to see the reset. You're going to go into reset and you're going to choose the second option that says erase all content and settings. This will do a hard reboot on the iPad. And that way, once it is done reloading and rebooting all the way through, it will be like you got a new iPad and it'll go through the steps again. It will say, hello, you're going to accept. Once you've accepted, you will have to choose your language, uh, which English, and you will also have to um, choose your location, the United States. And then you will also have to, again, go through the prompts and accept the remote management services. And lastly, you will also have to enable and allow there to be location services so the district can actually push out updates to your student's iPad. Once you've done so, uh, at that point, self-service should pop up, but you will need to allow there to be about two to three minutes for it to just load. And once that is done, you are set up and ready to go to download and install other applications through self-service. Now, if that does not work, then you will have to go to any Richardson campus and you can just sit in the parking lot and you will have to log on to the Richardson Wi-Fi. So here is the information for that. It's RISD Wi-Fi. The username you will put in is all lowercase RISD and the password will, password will be all lowercase user. So I will leave this screen up here for just a moment and you may pause the video as you need. If you are doing this from home and it does not work, once again, just go to any Richardson campus that is close by. You don't need to go into the school. Simply log on to the Richardson ISD Wi-Fi, the RISD Wi-Fi, and then try to wait a few minutes. If that doesn't work, restart the iPad, and I promise you it will show up. Now, if this doesn't work, please give us a call at North Lake so that I can, again, help you with any questions and concerns that you may have, and we will figure this out together. Appreciate your time, and I hope this helps. Have a great day.